Okay, now I'm going to talk a little bit about the rhythm guitar on a minor blues tune like that. I'm calling this tune Thrillin', but it's obviously a tip of the hat to B.B. King's uh, Thrill is Gone. But uh, there are a number of songs written pretty close to the same changes as this. Um, B.B. did this tune originally in B minor, and he often plays it now in the key of C minor. But I just moved that down to the key of A minor um, uh, for the purposes of demonstration, and uh, I thought it would work well. Um, so what I'm going to do, when you're playing rhythm guitar on a tune like this, it's a great idea, you know, you think about um, pacing yourself on the rhythm. And pl for instance, playing behind the vocals, you're going to want to play very simply and maybe um, uh, very sparsely, leave lots of room for the lyrics and all. And then, so you're going to be hitting some long tones, very simple. And I'm also using this slide, by the way. I'm going to uh, talk about, uh, I'm playing an A minor 7 chord on the top four strings. But I could be playing the A minor triad on the top three by itself also. Now I can slide the top three up to B minor or the top four. Both work well and I interchange them. I think everybody does. So we're going to be using those slides some and you can kind of uh, mix those in as you choose. Now when you get to the four chord, you can slide or, or the top three notes. That sounds great, doing the D minor triad up there. Um, as well, when you're playing the four chord down here on this root five D minor seven chord, you can take the note A and the note F and slide those two notes up. It sounds great for R&B fills around the four chord. So you're going to hear me doing that some as well. Um, so a few approaches. First chorus is going to play mostly long notes and just sustain the chords out. And then uh, the second chorus that I'm going to play uh, on, uh, on, the, on the video that follows here is going to be uh, a little busier, a little funkier, like I might play behind a soloist or something. Now, uh, before I play, I want to also say one other thing. Um, one thing that always works on a tune like this is to hit two and four. So if you're going one, two, three, four. Those short hits may be sliding two, three, four, one. That kind of a thing always works well for you when you're playing a tune like this. So always feel free to throw the off beats in uh, like that. Okay, so, uh, but I'm actually going to play uh, two different parts other than that. Uh, now, I'm going to play sustained chords and then something a little funkier, okay? All right. <laughs> 